Hey everyone, be sure to check out the Sleek Lens Members Club Facebook group page, which you can find by searching Facebook for Sleek Lens Members Club or by going to facebook.com slash groups slash Sleek Lens Members Club. There you can get help with your photography, discuss editing techniques, and stay up to date with Sleek Lens products. Here's a video that was posted to the group page to help one of our members. Hey Martina, this is Jordan from SleekLens.com. Uh, in this video, I wanted to try to help you out with an issue that you're having with your photos. Uh, I saw this uh, post right here on the Sleek Lens Members Club page, and uh, it says that you're trying to apply the Strike a Pose All-in-One Portrait Golden preset, and you noticed over here on the left, on uh, on this one plus a couple others, that it's turning the uh, the top left corner blue. And so I kind of wanted to help you out with that. So let's jump over to Lightroom, and I'll show you kind of what's going on. So here we are in Lightroom, and here's my photo. Uh, so I'm going to apply the same preset that you did. So I'm going to go over here to Strike a Pose, All-in-One, Portrait, Golden. And you can see I get the same sort of effect going on. The top right corner is, or the top left corner is blue. And so let me help you out with that. The reason it's doing that is because it's actually, when you apply this preset, it's also applying a gradient filter. Gradient filters are really cool to use in Lightroom. Uh, and so this is kind of the effect that it's giving. It's giving a more cool, to cool tone up here, warmer tone down here. The easiest way to correct that, if you want to go ahead and remove that, is to go to your gradient tool over here. You click that. And you'll see a little node right here. This little node is the blue portion that's being uh, being cast in your photo. And so you can see over here we have the temp, and that's what's making it blue. It's making the temp cooler. And so you could either take the temp up to where it's warmer, and it matches the rest of the photo, or you can go ahead and delete it and just have the all-in-one preset apply to uh, the, the main portion of the photo. You do have this node over here that, it, that also is warming it up a little bit, uh, but if you want to keep that one as well, that's cool. You can uh, keep it right there and change a little bit of the settings or you can just go ahead and delete it. Uh, but that's how you correct it, it's very simple. Uh, if you see some other presets that are kind of giving the same sort of effect in the in the kind of the corners, uh, most likely it's a gradient tool, so they're the gradient filter. You might want to check on that just to see if that's uh, something that you want to keep, change, or just get rid of. All right, Martina, I hope that helped you out, and if you have any more questions, please let me know. Uh, this is Jordan from SleekLens.com, and I'll see you guys next time.